Lung cancer is overgrowth of normal cells that start in the lung. Um, mutations can cause cells over time to be able to form tumors, and then eventually they can spread around the body and be a very serious illness. The lung is a common site of having cancer from other organs of the body, but when we as pulmonary talk about lung cancer, we are specifically referring to cancer that arise inside the lungs, whether they arise inside the airways or windpipes of the lung or the lung tissue. And the people who are at risk are primarily those who are smokers. Most lung cancers happen in people who smoke, and it's pretty uncommon for us to see lung cancer in people who don't smoke, although it is possible. So you may not always know when it's first developing. Um, some common symptoms could be a new cough, unexpected weight loss, um, any blood that you're coughing up. Um, the best way to detect lung cancer for anybody who's at high risk, like if you've been a smoker for a long time, is to undergo what's called a low-dose CT scanning. This is available for anybody over 50 with a significant smoking history. Um, so if you're a person like that, you should talk with your primary care doctor or call Franciscan directly um, to get scheduled for a CT screening. So if you look at all of medical oncology, lung cancer has probably had the most advancements in the last even five years. Um, there are probably four times as many drugs, I would say even five times as many drugs now than there were to treat lung cancer even five years ago. Um, for example, one of the most common things we use now that wasn't even on the table of five years ago is something called immunotherapy, which is basically a medication that helps boost your own immune system to fight lung cancer. And we can get remarkable responses for people even with really advanced disease. Um, there are just dozens of treatments now for lung cancer and I think that most patients are living longer uh, with better quality of life than even a couple of years ago. Robotic bronchoscopy is an upcoming uh, technique and um, Franciscan Hospital in Michigan City just acquired that technology and we are very excited about that because this is a technology that helps us to go after very small nodules. It's typically done under general anesthesia best part of this technology is that the nodules that we were never able to reach in the past or that required uh, more invasive procedures to get a diagnosis can be done with these minimally invasive technologies and robotic bronchoscopy falls into that category. So radiation is treatment with x-ray beams um, and x-rays can kill cancer cells and take care of tumors, um, but there has been a lot of development in the last uh, decade or two specifically around targeting the radiation directly to where the tumor is at so that you can avoid all the side effects of radiation to the rest of the tissue. Um, and there's a newer kind of treatment called stereotactic radiation, which is a very high dose of radiation that can be given to a small tumor in just a few treatments, sometimes as few as three. Um, and this has proven to be a very successful treatment for early stage lung cancers, um, especially patients who aren't able to get it surgically removed. We can usually get rates of cure that are just as high as surgery if we give this kind of radiation. At Franciscan in Michigan City, we are very fortunate to have a whole team uh, that helps us to take care of patients who are diagnosed with lung cancer. And we have multidisciplinary tumor boards once a week where we all talk about the cases. So that's what we strive for at Franciscan Health. We meet all together every week, discuss the case and come up with a plan and every doctor is aware of the plan from the very beginning. Um, and we believe this benefits from not only making it quicker, but also having lots of different points of views and lots of opinions from the very beginning so that you can have the best plan possible. So with the advent of all of the new technology we have in terms of treatments from a medical oncologist standpoint for lung cancer, um, all of the treatments that people can get in larger cities, we can give here at Franciscan, which is great for patients because it's really difficult to drive far away for treatments. Um, we have added dimensions of incorporating spiritual care, emotional, psychological support, social work all together to take care of you as an entire person. And this is done all right close to home so you don't have to get in the car and drive a long way.